against Basilides, number 4, but 24 of the series. Basilides then, as I have already explained, made his way to Egypt and spent some time and spent some time there. They went to Posopitis and Atribitis and moreover to the environs of Nun of Sets and Alexandria. For the Egyptians called the neighborhood or environs of a city of Anom. You may find you may find even this of, of use to you, scholarly reader, for love of learning and clarity's sake, clarity sake uh, as a pure confirmation and explanation to the pews in sacred scripture that bevel some because of their inexperience. Whenever you find a mention of norms of Egyptian cities in the Holy Prophet Isaiah, such as the norms, the norms of Tanis of Memphis, or the norm of Bubastis, it means that area around one city or another, and there, for love or, le or learning sake, learning sake, you have the translation. So this tribe spent his entire life in these places, the ones where he sick which flourishes even today after having taken occasion from his teaching appeared, and he began to preach much more material than the Carlatan who was his fellow student, and was left in Syria for the sake of seeming to do deceive his audience more completely, if you please, by telling them more than he had, and of gratifying and gathered more of a crowd than his colleges, his college. Saturnilus, now then, now then, to, uh, of gratifying and gathering more of a crowd than his colleagues, Saturnilus, now then, to fob some of his very stories, his very stories of, on us he begins them as follows, to, to tell the truth, he does begin the sucking, deadly things, for a notion of his own, but by taking his cue for Saturnilus and from Simon, whom we have already mentioned, he though wants to handle the then differently and give him if can and give his mythology at greater height. There was a, there was one in in general, he says, who alone is the father of all, from his mind has been emitted, for mind reason, from reason prudence, for prudence power and wisdom. And, the, and from power and wisdom, principalities, authorities, and uh, angels. From these powers and angels, the uh, highest first he, heaven has come, and other angels have come from them. And the angels who come from them have made a second heaven, and made, he and made angels themselves in the, in the turn. And the angels who come from them had made a third, he a third heaven. And so, by producing another heaven and other and other angels in turn, the angels of each heaven have brought number of heaven to 365 three hundred sixty-five, from the highest to this one above us. For fools, this might serve as a temptation to believe his crazy nonsense, but for the wise, it is easy to refute his speech and his way of perverting. His, op his own opinion into extreme, unbounded mischief. As though thunderstruck by some petty frenzy, this party excuse for a man assigns names to every icon in the heavens, and to the ruin of his dupe souls, publish, publishes them to win credence from the weak-minded to the names he makes he makes up. What is more, the cheat never un the cheat never played in his devotion to conjugal devices and mumbo-jumbo. He says that this creation was produced later by the angels of our heaven and the power in it. One of the angels he calls God and distinguishes him by saying that he alone is, God, is the God of the Jews, though he made him one of the number of the angels whose names he coined for us as though he were composing a mime. By him, the man was was fashioned. The angels, including himself, have fashioned the world out by lot to multitude of the angels, 
but this God of the Jews has drawn the Jewish people, and to insult this same Almighty God who, who alone and no other is the true God, for we confess that it is He who is the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ. Basilius, as I have sung, denies Him and represents Him as one of His so-called angels. The Jews have fallen to His Lord, and He defends them, but He is the most self-willed of all the angels, and He led the children of Israel out of the Egypt by the self will of His own arm. Since he was more reckless and self-willed than the others, hence, if the God, since hence this God of theirs has plotted, because of his full, because of his willfulness, the charlatan blasphemously says, the subject, the subject all the other nations to the stock of Israel, and has launched wars for this purpose. Altogether pathetic himself, though he is, he does not hesitate to give free rein to his tongue, speak up, and say many other things against the Holy God. He says it is for the it is for the reason that the other nations made on he made made war on this one and inflicted many evils on it because of the other and just jealously provoke since. They felt despised by the God of the Jews. They stirred, they stirred their own nations up against the nation of Israel, which was under his command. And this is why wars and disorders constantly broke out against them. This is the false specious argument. He too likewise believers, believes that Christ was manifest only an appearance. He says, that since he appears, he is an appearance, but he is not man and has not taken place. The second mime log, the second mime log amounts another dramatic piece for us in his account of the cross of Christ, for he claims, for he claims that not Jesus but Simon of Kiran has suffered. For when the Lord was marched out of Jerusalem, as the gospel says one Simon of Kiran com was compared to bear the cost. From this, he, he finds his trickery opportunity for composing his dramatic piece and says, Jesus changed Simon into his own form while he was bearing the cross and changed himself into Simon and delivered Simon to crucifixion in his place. During Simon's crucifixion, Jesus stood opposite his unseen loving and the persons who were crucifying Simon, but he himself flew, out, flew off to the heavenly realms after delivering Simon to crucifixion and returned to heaven without suffering. It was Simon himself who was, crucif who was crucified, not Jesus. Jesus, Basilides says, passed through to all the powers on his flight to heaven, this till he was restored to his own father. He is the father's son of whom he of whom we have spoken, sent to men's aid because of disorder that, that the father saw both in men and in angels. And he is our salvation, he says, who come and reveal this truth to us alone. Such are the recitals of the Trams mythology at this point, moreover, since the uncleanness which began with Simon is making strides, Basilides gives his disciples, permis his disciples permission to give the whole of every, of every kind of badness and licentiousness and gives his comforts full instruction in the promis promiscuous intercourse from an evil kind between man and woman, of them and the kind of the Apostle says, The right and righteous judgment of God is revealed against those who hold the truth in right and righteousness. For many fall into the heresy of for this reason of self-indulgence, since through this unnatural acts they find a way of doing the pleasure with impunity. Again, 
he, he gives a permissive sort of teaching by alleging that there is no need to be martyr. There will be no reward for a, for a martyr since he is not bearing witness to man's creature, he is testifying for the crucified Simon. Now, how can he have a reward when he does for Simon, the one who was crucified, while avowing that he is doing he is doing this for a Christ whom he knows nothing about, dying for someone he does not she does not know he is dying for. One must deny that, deny then, and not die rashly. But this man will apprehend it as hitting a horse of devils against by against soul by teaching against souls by teaching them the denial of God. Since the Lord himself says Whosoever denied me before men, him will I deny before the, my Father who it, which is in heaven. But the tram says, We are the men. The, the others are all swine and dogs, and this is why he said, Just not the pills before swine, and neither give the which, and neither give that which is holy unto dogs. For Basilides hides his own weakness from people with sense, but discloses it to his own coterie and the ones he has duped, duped because it is indeed a shame, a shame even to speak of the of the things they said and do. They say and do. He says he, he says that one must confess the truth before men, for we are the human. But the other, but the others are swine and dogs, as I as I said. Basilides claims that. They may not reveal anything at all to anyone about the Father and about his own mystery, but must keep it secret between themselves and reveal it to one of thousands and two out of ten thousands. He cautions his disciples by saying, Know all men yourself and let, and let no man know you. When questioned, he and his followers claim that they are no longer Jews and had no and have not yet become Christians, but that they always deny, keep the faith secret within themselves and tell it to no one, anticipating his own shame because of the unspeakable nature of his obscenity, obscenity and bad doctrine. The beginning of his weak pretense has its cause had it has had its cause in searching for the origin of evil and saying that and saying what it was but what every person is like will be soon be by his business hence these people who live who love evil and not good are messians of evil as the scripture said they that seek mischief it shall come unto them they never was such as a, they never there never was a such thing as evil there has never there has never a root of evil, or evil is not a thing. At one time, evil did not exist, but in anyone who does it, it exists as something that has been imported with it to him by reason of his doing it. In one who does not do do it, it does not exist, as explained above. For for after he had, he has made all this, for after he has made all things, the Lord says. Behold, as things as are very good, proving that evil is not primordial and did not exist at the beginning, before it was begun by man, through us it comes into being, and through us it does not. Therefore, since everyone has the ability not to do evil and the ability to do it, evil exists when it does when he does it, but is non-existent when he does not. So, what becomes of the root of evil or the substance of weakness? Basilides has arrived at a point of great folly by claiming that the power, of high, the power on high emitted mind, that mind emitted reason, reason emitted prudence, prudence emitted power and wisdom, and that authorities powers and angels spring from power and wisdom. Yet, over and above that, he says that 
the power and the first principle above this is abra is abrasax because the sum of the letters of abrasax is 365 so that so that from so that from this he tries to establish the, the evidence of his myth of the 365 heavens he even um, he even maps out the locations of these heavens with great care by his practice of dividing and combining them like the mathematicians for he and his subordinates have taken their future speculations and applied them to their own type of, spec of speculation for the sake of their own delusive false teaching and they would like to give proof of these things from figures that are similar to them since Abrasax makes 365 I said and proof if you please that this is why a year of the uh, and this is why a year has 365 days per cycle and his silly argument is a failure a year in fact consists of 365 days and 3 hours and he says then he says a man also has 365 members of all this reason so that he can assign one member to each the powers he contrived spurious teaching fails in this fa fails in this as well there are 364 members in a man but the blessed Irenaeus the successor of the of the apostles has gone into detail about him and given and given a marvelous refutation of his stupid of his stupidity now now too there will be a refutation for the nonsense of this basilides who has come down from on high after taking a good look at this at what is up there or rather who has fallen who has fallen down white of who has fallen down white of the mark of the truth for this for if this heaven has been made by its angels and they by the higher ones and the higher ones by ones higher still then the power on high also called abraxas abrasax will have to be the one which which has made everything and the cause of all that is and nothing and and nothing can have been made apart from it since they declare it to be to be the cause and and first archetype and their so and their so called deficiency of this world can have been produced by nothing other than the first principle and cause the thing and cause of the things that came later. But we need to ask him why take us to such a branch, Mister, and not rather to the first principle that is to the one God the Almighty, since by all accounts he either means this or in on his premises or to confess the the one curse of all as master and moreover you comfort you composer of this work of fiction give us an answer on on the subject of Christ if Simon of Kiran was crucified then our then our salvation has not been secured by Jesus but by Simon and the world can no longer hope to be saved to Jesus Christ who did not suffer for us for Simon cannot save us either, he is a man and nothing but. And at the same time, you are also accusing God's only begotten son of false, of false prosecution if the God delivered someone else by force to be murdered in his place. And for the rest, and for the rest something like this, sometime, something like this must be a dream, or rather must be a work of malignity and trickery, that the Lord concealed himself by some trickery or other and delivered someone else in his place. And your foolish chatter amounts to a false prosecution of the truth, a prosecution that cannot succeed by stands convicted by truth by the truth itself of introducing fiction without proof. For the truth altogether refutes this heresy in the Old and New Testaments. Anyone can see that Christ went to his passion freely and that he took flesh and became man among us by his own 
will and his fathers with the Holy Spirit's consent. This, though he was perfect God from the first, begotten of the Father without beginning and not in time, but in the last days he, consecrate, he consented to enter virgin womb, form in flesh, form flesh from his home himself, was truly born and assured but and assuredly made man to suffer for us in the flesh itself and give his life for his own sheep. So and so he refused the these people by saying, Behold, we go up to Jerusalem, and the Son of Man shall be delivered up and put to death, and the third day he shall rise again. And to the son and to the sons of Zebedee he said, Are ye able to drink the cup that I shall drink of? And as the, as the Apostle Peter also says, being put to death in the flesh but quickened by the Spirit, and again who suffered for us in the flesh, and again John says, Whoso denied the Christ, that Christ is come in the flesh, and the same is Antichrist. And St. Paul says, Having tasted of death, even the, even the death of the cross, as Moses also foretold, Ye shall see your life hanging on the tree, and Simon is not our life, and Simon is not our life. The Lord who suffered for us to put an end to our sufferings, and who by dying in the flesh has become the death of death to bring to bring to break the sting of death that descending to the underworld to set the the unbreakable backs. And having done this and having done this he led the host of captives, of captive souls, to the heavens and emptied Hades. Christ was not responsible for Simon's death. He, resurren he surrendered himself. What do you mean, you crazy man in the world? If he didn't want to be crucified, couldn't he, couldn't he have said so frankly and gone away from them? Would the Son of God, the Divine What? lay a teacher a tricus snare and hand and hand someone else overdo that by crucifixion in his place the one who said i am the truth for he says i am the truth and the life the life would not engender a death for someone else nor would the truth conceal what it's truly doing and misrepented and misrepresented truth cannot be truth Truth cannot be truth if it practices imposture and conceals its own act, but works together, but works to an anti artifice which is the opposite of it, which is the opposite of it. And to say, and to say it all in a word so as not to prolong the discussion, woe to the word because of offenses, and them that work iniquity. How many, how many have turned out to be darkness? for themselves and darkness for the others after them who trust in their darkness but to the wise the truth will be made clear but the business of Basilides and his kind be exposed and as a work of imposture and so much for this sake and this myth I shall go on from here to another heresy for who can fail to release that this sort of heresy is a myth and like a horn ship up lies buried in the sand but pokes up into the air with its with it with its horn, and inflicts death on those who happen upon it. Upon it, however, the Lord had broken the horn of sinners and the horn of Cyrus alone, which means trust in truth shall be assaulted. Therefore, since we have broken Basilides too with the doctrine of the truth, let us go on to the sex follow to the sex following, calling us calling us our help on God to whom be glory, honor, and worship forever and ever, forever and ever. Amen.